The jig is put into position and helps ensure that the cuts made to the bone are exactly what are needed. Now hammer in the pins to hold the jig. We can now remove the alignment device. The pins will hold the jig firmly in place. Now for some real bone shaping. Use the bone saw to cut the bone so it is prepared for the new femoral component. Another cutting jig, along with the bone saw, allows us to finish shaping the femur. Let's move on and shape the tibia. The tibial cutting jig is aligned with the big toe and the highest point of the tibia. This will ensure the leg is properly aligned after surgery. Secure the jig in place with more pins. Use the bone saw to cut off the top of the tibia and prepare it for the new tibial components.